That's the way to get a bully back, man. Get him in the mind. You know what I mean? Everybody knows bullies can't read. I don't know what happened, but they can never read. They can never read. It's kind of sad. You're in the fourth grade. Why the fuck can't you read? You know what I mean? This, how, do you, how do you do anything? How do you go to McDonald's? You don't know what it says? Uh, that one. Uh, let me get that one. No. It's sad. It's sad. That's where all your gangbangers come from. Right? All, your, all your thugs who just go out and kill people. That's where they come from. Right. They were the Quantavis of the bunch. <laughs> to be honest, I don't even know anyone named Quantavis. I was a ghettoest name I could think of. You know what I mean? <laughs> I was like, what? <laughs> Sound like a Greek warrior, Quantavis. <laughs> That's perfect. I'll go with that. I'll go with that. I made that up, you guys. Nah, I'm good. Anybody in here dating? You guys. I know you guys are dating. You try to play. You guys are dating, right? You guys are dating? Married? Excellent. Please stay strong, man. That's beautiful. That's beautiful. <laughs> Mary, everybody give it up for Mary. <laughs> Marriage is beautiful, man. It's beautiful, man. It's just harder for me to date now. It's getting, that's what I realized. It's getting harder for me to date, right? And the thing is, I blame these rappers. Okay? <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> Lil Wayne, Drake. Fuck them dudes, man. <laughs> Making a random recession. I can't compete. I'm out of the race. I can't compete. I'm like, okay, you're dropping money. All right, I'll just leave. You know what I mean? Like, I'll just do it. It's sad, man. It sucks. You know what I mean? It's these rappers, man. Like, I had to break up with my last girlfriend because of this exact problem. Like, the rappers, they, they're dropping money on women. You know what I mean? So they just lack class. Like, it just lowers the class level, right? They're like, I'm fine. I'll just go fuck this rapper. You know what I mean? Get rich. That's not the way it goes, right? <laughs> And that's fucking up the game for me. I'm a nerd. I can't, I can't do any of that shit. I'm like, oh, I like Pokemon. What do I do in this situation? <laughs> I don't know what to do. I don't have that thug quality. I have dimples. I fall short of the thug, the thug profile, right? So it's hard for me, right? And the thing is, I'm not going to blame it on her, right? I didn't break with her because of her. It was me. It's half my fault, right? Because I brought out her woho, right? You guys know what woho is, right? No? Okay, let me educate you real quick. Woho, right? It's a woman's inner hoe. So, inner hoe. It's almost like an alter ego. It's crazy. It, it comes out on rare occasions, right? You'd be like, you are a rare horn. Wow. I did not know this was you, right? It's rare. It's rare. Like, for instance, you guys are a couple, right? Okay, say you're at home watching a movie. Okay, you guys are just chilling, relaxing, as couples do. Enjoy each other's company, you know what I mean? Right? Right? And then you drop this comment at the end of the movie. Oh man, that Denzel, he, he's just an awesome actor, right? And she's like, yeah, uh, me and my girlfriend in college, she said uh, we, he'd be the only guy we'd have a threesome with. Whoa, whoa, ho. whoa. 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 We are not at that phase of the relationship, just dropping threesomes? That's not okay. Whoa, whoa, ho, whoa, right? It's scary, it's scary because you don't know when it's gonna happen, right? You don't know. So there's certain places that I found out, there's certain places that if you take your girl here, it will bring out her whoa, ho, right? I didn't know this, okay? I was the young in the game, I didn't know, right? So all the fellas in this room, listen up right now, listen up, seriously. Seriously, I'm getting emotional right now. Seriously. <laughs> I took my girl to a rap concert. Please, sir, don't fucking do that. Please don't do it. Please, I beg you, please don't do it. There's nothing good that can come out of taking your woman to a rap concert, right? I was dumb. I was like, uh, uh, yeah. Because people were telling me I look like this guy, right? I took her to see Wiz Khalifa. <laughs> okay, yeah. It's funny now. Wait till you're doing the story, right? I was feeling myself. I was like, yeah, you know what I'm saying? I'm about to go to my own concert. You know what I mean? I'm not even tripping. You know what I mean? This is my show, right? So I should have known something was wrong, because as soon as we got there, she just took off. I was like, whoa, 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 okay. You know, where'd you go? <laughs> Uh, you're supposed to be with me. That means she's too excited to see whoever the fuck's on stage, okay? She's too excited. She ran to the front quicker than I did. I was like, okay, hold on. He's probably my twin. You need to back up. Calm it down. I didn't know, right? We went to the front. That's another thing. I'm real structured. Like, I told you I like Pokemon. I like things in order. You know what I mean? I was like, yeah, let's get to the front. Sounds like the most bang for my buck. You know what I mean? Let's get the best show possible, right? No. 
Please don't do that shit either. Please don't. I didn't know at a concert or any entertainment venue for that matter. All the hoes are in the front. All the hoes, because that's where it's prime screaming range. It's a perfect opportunity, like, I fucking love you. They're like advertising their vaginas right in front. You know what I mean? Like, I'm good. You know what I mean? Like they're trying to catch a rapper baby. I didn't know. I was new to the game. I didn't know. I didn't know. Right? So we're there, she's just screaming, just screaming. Oh, I fucking love you. You're sexy. Handed him her number right in front of me, right? Hurt my feelings. I stepped away. I was like, I was like, I don't even know her. They're like, hey, you, you want us to help you get back to your girl? I was like, I don't, I don't fucking know her. Who, who's that? Who is that? Right? I was like, don't talk to me, man. I was in a bad place. I was in a bad place. I was sad, right? So the only thing I could think of to do in that situation was get her back, right? So you know what I did? I just fucking left. I just did. I was like, all right, peace. I hope you catch a baby. I hope you're happy. I just left. <laughs> hope you get what you want, bitch. I just left, right? I was so mad, right? I did what I do best. I'm good with words. I sent her an angry text message. You know what I mean? I'm good in writing. I was like, damn, that looks good, man. You know what I mean? That's a good text. I was like, <laughs> seriously, man, the power of the written word. It's powerful. I wrote it down. I was like, bam, it's perfect, right? I said, you know what? I hope you have two dollars, because the next 91 hours not for 45 minutes. Play, uh, I just hit her. Like, all, hella A's, too, to make my point, you know what I mean? Hella A's. Like, message two of two, all A's. All A's. It's like, you gonna feel me right now. No, you wanna yell at rappers? Okay, I got you, I got you. So I sent her an angry text message. I'm not gonna lie, man, that, that was probably one of the only goals, like, after that concert, that's the only goal I had to get famous so I could beat the shit out of Wiz Khalifa. That's, that's really the only reason I wanted to do it. That's the really only reason. Like, I'd just catch my like, Grammy show or something, you know what I mean? Just have it all prepared, just be pacing backstage. Mm -hmm. <laughs> What's funny? Nothing's even funny. Why are you always laughing? Okay. You know what I mean? Just be mad at him for no reason. <laughs> just catch him slipping with an uppercut. Pow! You know what I mean? But I'm not gonna lie, like, I'll probably start to get emotional. You know what I mean? Like I'm having some sort of breakthrough right when I hit him. You know what? Fuck you, this is for that concert, bitch. You know what I mean? <laughs> start to cry, you know what I mean? I'll be in the corner with his chains. I'm upon this shit. <laughs> you got him, girl, you got him. You got him, he ain't gonna take your girl again. He gonna remember now. You know what I mean? Like that kind of stuff. Just emotional with that kind of stuff. You know what I mean? But I can't be mad. I can't be mad, you know? It does look fun to be a rapper. You know what I mean? It does look fun. Be honest. Everybody, come on. Does it look fun to be a rapper? Be honest. They just get to throw money at people. You know what kind of power that is? Like, think about that. Yeah, making it rain. If Wiz came in here right now and threw a stack of hundreds in my face, what, I'm going to be mad about it? You know what I mean? I'm going to put that front up. Oh, bitch. Ugh. Okay, I need rent. You're an asshole. You're an asshole. You're an asshole. But I do like black and yellow. It's okay. It's okay. It's not that bad. This is crazy, man. Being a rapper is hard, man. Making it rain. I can't make it rain. I might drizzle some dimes, like right here. Just, you know what I mean? But that would add up quick, I feel like. You know, that's like a big Mac meal in 30 seconds. I'm not wasting that. It's stupid. It's retarded. We got birthdays in the house. Birthday girl over here. Yeah. Everybody in the room officially hates her. Oh, I wish it was my birthday. <laughs> That's how it goes, man. I hate birthdays. I hate other people's birthdays. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. Like, the second you step in the room, you're like, it should be my fucking birthday. Damn it! Why is this yours? You know what I mean? I used to hate it. You know what I used to hate? People, like, their cake flavors. Right? I know that's, that's selfish, but this is about me, it's your birthday. So like, I used to get mad. <laughs> like, I remember this one kid got carrot cake, I just wanted to fight him. I was like, I'm fucking leaving. You got carrot cake? What are you, 40? I'm out of here. I'm leaving. <laughs> like, damn, man. Shit's got like, chopped up almonds on the top. This is not a sugar rush. I'm dipping. It's too healthy. So man, you don't get that buzz. You know what I mean? That cake buzz <sighs> when you're a kid. Just get that buzz. Like, some people also used to like to get the whipped icing. Fuck you if you like whipped icing. For real, that's how I feel. I'm on the pro sugar icing part of 
life. Like, I'm in that gang, if that's a gang. You know what I mean? Like, sugar icing gang, we fucking people up, you know what I'm saying? But like, I just hate birthdays, right? Because what I got for my birthday, I was born in December, right? December 27, two days after Christmas. So my parents were always dead ass broke. I was like, oh man, all right. And then with like combined with gifts, like this is your Christmas Kwanzaa birthday present. I was like, oh. And it was socks every time, like some, a pair of socks, you know what I mean? I was always getting socks. Like my grandma was saying the same duct taped ass package full of socks. I was like, Grandma, the way this is taped, there should be something cool in here. <laughs> you know what I mean? Even if the person stole this package, they would mail it back to me like, oh, fuck, this kid got socks for Christmas? This is fucked up. <laughs> Seriously. But like, other people's birthdays, man, I used to go in there, like, I used to hate the gifts that they got. Like, I would just be envious, like, they just get PS2, sock of offers, all the hot 90s shit, you know what I mean? The super sucker that's a little too strong, shots me in the eye, kind of hurt a little bit. You know what I mean? You're like, okay, yeah, you, you're definitely winning the Super Circuit Pride. I'm not fucking with you after this. <laughs> you got the big blaster? Okay, damn. That shit's too rough. Like, kind of peel your skin back. It's not a big deal. It's just not what I was upset about as a kid. You know what I mean? People always, it's always a headshot, too. Everybody's angry for the face. <laughs> but I mean, it's just gonna make me mad, right? So one year, I saw this kid, he dropped his sock of boppers on the floor. Needless to say, I had sock of boppers that year. You know what I mean? And one of my pops brought it back, hid it in his backyard the day after. He didn't even know. Now, but I'm Pharaoh Daniels. You guys have a great night. You guys have been beautiful. Make sure you can follow each other on Twitter at Pharaoh Last. And you guys have a great night. Thank you, Jamie.